You ain't doing shit. Call me. No, really. A really little boy. Fucking fox. You can do that, but ah, it's too easy. You. It's too easy. It's too easy. Hold on now. No one's gonna lose. Doesn't matter. The big blood, the big bitch. Shut up, little boy. I'm not gonna lose. You're a big bitch. What is old head? What the fuck does it? Jumper! I'm bro, a what? Shoot a shoot, bro. I guard him better than you, bro. Let me get it. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, you guard him better than me? Last point three. Only... Don't be a bitch. You can Last only get three. one key on him. This guy is unplugable, bro. I'm 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 I can have so much on him. Too easy to take the crap, but I'll take the fake. I'll do whatever I want. No, but like, what? Can I score the ball? We can't score the ball, though, bro. We can't score the ball. I'm a shooter. 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 I'm a Oh my god. Oh my god. You put the 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 Good still big bird. You see that ball real quick. Look at him reaching. You want to reach on me? You fool. <laughs> That's where you messed up. Uh... Oh my goodness, we're hitting everything. We're hitting everything. Ooh, where are you going? Don't make me hit you with the double! The double! Do I point? I don't need to point! I don't need to point every time! I don't need to point every time! Oh, keep it going! Double team, get shit, big back! Ah! I'm hitting everything! Uh... Help me! Are you giving up? Help! Don't give up, me! Bro. You got it, bro. Come on, bro. Give me the clip. Oh my goodness. I'm flowing. I'm flowing. Uh... Oh my god. Oh, I hit that. I know I did. I know I did. So you just swiping at the ball, ain't you? Okay, you a little bumpy. You a little bumpy. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. You a little bumpy. I'm the big blood. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness gracious. Oh, gee, Willikers. Oh, geez, Louise. With the double. The double. I put. I don't need to point every time. What's understood don't need to be explained. I don't need to point. Lock take, no take. I take matters into my own hands. Big dog shit. You're I'm actually ass. Nigga, you're, you're fucking rude. Nigga, you're, you're, you're not good, good bitch. Guy. I'm out of here. Wow. I guess we're not good, yo. You suck hey, on God. Hey, you hey, suck hey, on God. You suck. You're horrible. Kill your. On God, dude? Now it's time to give y'all the jump shot of doom. But not only am I going to be giving y'all the jump shot, I'm going to be giving y'all everything to show you how to use the motherfucker. Now look, you see me at the stage going crazy. They can't guard me anywhere! I'm literally unguardable. Oh my goodness! The moves is something you've never seen before. The jump shot, the last one I gave y'all, they broke that shit. I stopped playing for a month, came back, and they obliterated the LaMelo Oscar! But now, I got a new jump shot, as you can see. Not only for the small builds, but you know Steezo got it all for the big builds as well. The 6'3", the 6'3 and up, the 6'9s, I got everything. This is the greatest channel in the goddamn world. Hit the like, hit the subscribe, turn the noties on. I got the donation thing going with the super thanks y'all could donate. I never got a donation before. Y'all could do that now. We about to get into it. I give y'all everything. Let me take my glasses off. Every fucking year. And I'm gonna do it again. I went to the stage, I gave them the God of AIDS, and now they about to meet their fate. Let's get into it. 
Now, as you can see, I'm just all over this court. What's the most important thing for shooting? You have to get open. So if you haven't watched my dribble tutorial now, go watch it. I'm like nobody. They don't know how to guard me because I don't just. Mm, mm, mm. I go all over the fucking place. It's unpredictable. That's how you gotta be, people. Spin backs, nutmegs, you just don't know what you're getting. The open shot is the easiest shot. The shot that doesn't use adrenaline boost when you shoot with all three will be the easiest to green. You must learn the movement. It helps with the shot. That is rule number one, people. Go watch it if you haven't watched it. But as you can see, my shot timing, I'm going to break it down. First things first, I use a shot timing that nobody else in the game uses. You know I'm different, people, and I'm going to show y'all how to be different, too, which is going to make me not different anymore. So, like, you know, you don't got to do it. I like feeling special, but we all can feel special together. We can, we can be different together. So the shot timing that I use that nobody else uses until maybe after hopefully this video is shot timing very late. Now I know what you're thinking. That's too late, Steezo. Well, I have one of the quickest jumpers in the game. I'm going to get into it. But you want to use this jumper on very late or late. I'll, go, I'll, I'll let you get away with late if you want. But very late is what I use and I'm gonna tell you why and I said this in my last jump shot video the very late gives my mind enough time to see what type of jumper they're giving me because as you know in this jam in, in this game they give you three different types if not five it's just a bunch of different timings they got timings for timing so if the shot is very late as I go up I have enough time to see okay they're gonna give me a slower timing do you get what I'm trying to say as I rise up they give you different timings so the very late time will let you know one of the five timings that you need the time you get it let me explain all right they give you five timings and the very late gives you enough time in your rise to see which one of the five timings they get you that's what I meant to say now that's why i use very late on this jump shot and honestly i would use it for all jump shots but let's get into the jump shot so the jump shot that i use is this jump shot well 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 now as you can see there it is people the lamello oscar with a twist the lamello oscar but then we throw in brucey e. b because what Bruce Brown actually does, it speeds up the jumper. I don't know what they did to my LaMelo, but they made it kind of slow. So we went 89 Oscar with 11% Bruce Brown on the release. Now, let me give y'all a secret. All we're using the Bruce Brown to do on the second release is to speed up the jumper. So, with that being said, I actually started with 5% Bruce. Then I went to 10% Bruce, because it was too slow still. Then I went to 15% Bruce, and then it became too fast. So it was really about finding that sweet spot. So all we use Bruce Brown to do is to speed or slow down the jumper, and I found the perfect sweet spot for me, which is 11% Bruce Brown. It goes perfect for my visual cue, which is what I'm gonna get into, the visual cue, because that's really everything. That's why we use the very late timing so we can see on the rise when the visual cue will be on the rise of the jump shot. I'm a fucking genius. I tried to tell y'all, hit the like, hit the subscribe. This jumper is money. This is the six foot three jumper and I'm gonna get into the six foot nine after this. But let me just tell y'all, this jumper is money. LaMelo, Oscar, Brucey B. The visual cue for this jumper will be at the peak of the jump shot. So whenever I see my player rise and he gets to his peak in the flick of the wrist, when the wrist starts to flick and starts to kind of push, that's when I let go of square and I put it on very late timing and it's money every single time. Same with the fades. You do it enough times, you repetition yourself enough, you're going to understand that it's the same. 
you're gonna see the motion just go to the you know my court go to the prime arena this works for current and next gen by the way people all my you know dribble moves tutorials they translate to both i make sure just wait for the peak it, you, you'll see it i'll put it right there on the screen on the peak you know the peak and when the wrist starts to just push that's when i go experiment with it see where you know you can kind of apply that to any jump shot you use too so you see with this jump shot tutorial i'm teaching y'all how to shoot no matter what the very late will translate to other jumpers the visual cue definitely translate to all jumpers you just got to know your visual cue people that's literally it i look at my player when i shoot i don't look at the hoop i don't look at the defender i'm literally looking at his wrist i'm looking at his arm and i'm trying to see and the very late will give me enough time because it's like five different jumping timings you know he either goes up quick that's a quick one if he goes up a little slow you got to hold it longer as you can see just gives you enough time because some jump shots bro especially on the crab i'm gonna do a whole crab tutorial by the way you know i shoot a lot of crabs the crab shots they're sped up people wonder like steezo how are you so money when you crab people because crab shots are some of the hardest shots in the game and it actually speeds up your jump shot but since i play on very late timing it's not too quick so i'll crab somebody and if i played on like a quick timing a crab shot would just be literally me tapping square and letting go right away it'd be too quick to time consistently but since i play on very late even when i crab people even when they speed up my jump shot when they contest it i still can time it very very consistently because it's not really a quick release like imagine playing on very quick or quick and they speed up your timing how hard is that to recognize because sometimes you don't know they're going to speed it up and they do so you have to adjust really quickly i'll never have that problem because i play on very late i know it's kind of confusing but if you understand what i'm trying to say then you will get it let's move on one more jumper i'll give y'all since we're here you know for guards if you don't like the last one i give you i'm gonna give y'all the one that all the comp players use it is kevin porter jr base it's the quickest base in the game one of the quickest and i like to go double oscar on it oscar oscar on the kevin porter jr and as you can see this one's just a quick jump shot if you are into quick jump shots it goes very well with the very late as well Kevin Porter Jr. is one of the most compy, just uh, meta bases that most guards use in the game. I don't prefer it. I prefer the Lamelo. The Lamelo just makes more sense to me. But Kevin Porter Jr. is a good one if you don't like the Lamelo base for your guard. I'm going to just go ahead and leave it right there. Kevin Porter Jr., Oscar, Oscar. Fool around. If you want it quicker, always go with the Bruce Brown. It'll speed up your jump shot. Same thing. Just the put the bruce brown on the second release and up the percentages and you can adjust it from there practice makes perfect always you want to be open that is what you need to do go watch the dribble tutorial if you haven't moving on to the six nine though now for the six foot nine it's literally the same jumper i've always used if it ain't broke don't fix it this is the jumper i use to wager ticino with my six nine now i don't really use the six nine too much anymore i use more of the new six three so i haven't been playing on my six nine a lot lately but when i do go on my six nine it's the same jumper i use to beat ticino with that is lamello oscar oscar if it ain't broke don't fix it that is the jump shot you want same logic as my other jump shot same visual cue on the flick of the wrist i put it on very late when it starts to flick you know at the height of the jump shot that's when we release the square button we get used to the five different timings and that's how we gain most of our shot every clip if you haven't noticed i finished with the jump shot preferably a three and I'm not talking about the wager. Yeah, I dunked in there. I did quick drops. But anything that you see me do a long dribble clip to, I finished with a three or a midi. I am the greatest shooter on NBA 2K23. All of my shots are shots. Think about what I just said. I be shooting after the clip. I end my clips and I look for my threes. This is the right channel to find your jump shots. I know what I'm talking about. Subscribe, turn the noties on. I gave y'all the jump shot. I'm keeping my promises. I gave y'all the dribble tutorial. I gave y'all the build the jump shot next. What more do you want?
let me know below what you want from me whether it be badges whether it be another bill anything i got y'all this is sensei steez i do more dribble tutorials i'll get y'all right going into 2k 24 and when 24 drops we gonna get you right on 24 and then when 25 drops we gonna get you right on 25 i am the greatest channel when it comes to this 2k shit i've been doing this for years since 2k 16 it is i steezo sensei steez don't believe in yourself believe in me believe in the steezo that believes in all of you i love every single one of y'all follow me on tiktok follow me on instagram follow me on the socials y'all have a beautiful blessed day Oh